John's story is that I have this huge injury. We were at the school awards. Joe was getting the awards for everything. And I was getting the award for drawing, uh, technical drawing. And Joy was in charge of the seating, and she sat herself beside me. Mm. That's true. I ended up beside you. I don't think I arranged the I seating. I think you did. That's what you told me. Oh, okay. You see, the time has, has altered memories. <laughs> 50 odd years ago. Well, it's, Joy was 15, so how? 66. 66. Oh, was he, yeah, that's, that's right. That's right. Mm. And then he went off to Teachers College, and I thought, oh dear, that's the end of it. But he still walked past my house every day, so <laughs> I used to wait. <laughs> Bush wait. Bush wait. <laughs> oh, we're just walking by. Here am I, just going to school now. <laughs> I'll just pop out the front door and walk with you. <laughs> Joey had short hair. Yeah, that's right. He didn't like short hair. So I dutifully grew my hair. <laughs> mm. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. It just happened, didn't it? Yeah, it was a process. Mm. When John got called up, he had to make a decision about whether he was going to go back to Holland that wasn't really a decision, it was an option. It was an option, that's mm -hmm. right. Mm -hmm. uh, we got in our combi van and went in our VW. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So that was the start, that was when we really got together. When we. That's when we left home. When we left home, yes. We had, yeah, that's right. Several fitting out of the combi van. We, we went through a few combis, but the first one we bought was... Forget about being pregnant. Oh yes, yeah, that's right. As well in that time. So we were getting fairly <laughs> close. <laughs> that's right, because I got pregnant at the end of year 12 that's with right. Michaela. Well, it wasn't a great look being pregnant school captain. <laughs> Pretty horrible. I mean, the, the baby, mm. you had the baby and they whisked it away. You weren't even allowed to mm. see the baby and... I mean, you got this little glimpse of them taking the baby away, which... Well, I didn't want you bonding with the I baby, know. because mm -hmm. they wanted the babies gone before there's any emotional yeah. sort of... But it was, it, the upset. whole process was oh, yeah. pretty horrible. Clinical. Clinical and horrible. Yeah, at that stage we couldn't offer mm. a baby all the things that you'd like to offer your kids. And I mean, with the benefit of hindsight, that's probably not how it was, but... I mean, you're young yourself, mm. you make decisions how you are at that time. Um, yeah, so it was, it was a big decision, it was very painful, but as I say, it, it still felt like the right decision at that time. Mm. It's, yeah. It wasn't until we actually had our own kids much, much later that you suddenly realised what you'd given up and what you missed and what that actually meant. And then we were just lucky. We, for a long time in Queensland, we couldn't, we couldn't get details of who had adopted kids and then the law changed. So we made inquiries and we wrote to her and she wrote a nice letter back. And she wrote, the first time we met, she came to Mum's place in Brisbane and yeah, it was pretty, pretty emotional, mm. but it was, yeah, it's been good. Mm. I mean, every relationship goes up and down and you have your, your highs and your lows, but I think, um, you, yeah, if you're prepared to stick at it, and it's never been... I think it's both, that we sort of had similar direction we yeah, wanted to go, right. yeah. but also we complemented each other in, when we did things, we had the skills between us to do do things we wanted to do. That's right. He pays, or he spends the money. I pay the bills. <laughs> or the, the macro, I get a crazy idea. And yeah, Joy, that's right. Joy manages the idea. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Let's let's go to China, import kitchens. Yeah, and who does all the paperwork and arranges all and the trips? And same with the gallery. Let's start an art gallery or whatever. Again, I go out and do that. Buying and all that, and Joy's at home, <laughs> keeping it together. I think I think you've just got to be 
prepared to work at a relationship and I think you can be lucky, you can grow together or you can grow apart as you get older. Um, but because we've always been going in the same direction, I think it's been easy in that way. Yep. Joy didn't want to go to China. No. Joy no. didn't. So. Well, you were going to go to China. I wasn't involved. <laughs> That's it. No. no it's so just... it was a compromise. <laughs> well, we did know. what the compromise was. We did what John wanted. <laughs> That's it. That's, that's he's it. just wearing out. He's worn. Out. He's just worn down, and worn out, and tired. Whereas what I do, because it's not as physical as what John does, I can do it a bit longer. He went to auction and bought more paintings last week, and he went to auction two weeks before that and bought more paintings. So he keeps telling me. I'm going to do something. Yeah. So I'm waiting to see what the next. Um, to see what we're going to do next. With, with the thousands of paintings. No, maybe not thousands. No. Hundreds of paintings. I've only got about 300. So yes. not, not many, but I'm going to do something with them. Yeah, maybe nothing will come of them. I'll just sell them all through auction, but <laughs> it's nice to have a collection in case I. In case? In I case. do something. <laughs> <laughs> It's always the next scoop. <laughs> when we had the opening of the gallery, and the opening was good, we were down to our last hundred bucks or something, I think, by the time we opened, and I, went, I didn't have anything to wear. And I went and bought this, this um, blue velvet outfit, and I spent $80 on it. And that was most of the money that we had left. <laughs> anyway, we had the opening, got to of the morning and I woke up on the floor, on the the floor in the gallery and then I woke up and then the next morning and I said well that was the gallery so what's next <laughs> I was happy we'd got to the opening so ah, then the hard work started but it was alright yeah. having having cleaned up lots of other people's estates I'm now of a mind to uh, start getting rid of all our material yeah. the, all our material things and scaling back, but John's not at that point yet. Because I just keep thinking. Yeah, oh. I bring it in the front door and Joy takes it out the back door. I try, I try, I try but I'm not very successful. Yeah. So, right. yeah. I like that the, the spiritual concept that, that as you get older, you kind of uh, you go back into the forest and sit and meditate. You know, 